It's time to get your risk on. Hello, everybody. Welcome back to my channel. Thank you for watching my video. I'm Digitalic. I'm a Grandmaster ranked online risk player. If you today were back with my Anything Goes account, we're still the yellow man with no face uh, from Canada. Uh, and we're going to play some progressive capitals on the classic map today. Uh, let's see how we do. It looks like one player did not ready up, so we will have a starting bot. And that is the green player. All right, I'm yellow. Um, blizzards are mostly inconsequential. Nothing crazy that cuts the map off. Uh, I don't love my cap spots. I go fourth. The only players that can roll me are purple or orange. Hmm. Don't really have anything that I like. A huge stack in Peru, but Peru, the Peru cap sucks. Western Europe, maybe? Where's purple going to go? I don't think purple likes their spots either. They might go Southern Europe. That will make Western Europe even shittier for me. Maybe purple's botting out. I don't know, guys. <laughs> okay, so they go they go Ontario. Green bot goes Egypt. I actually like the Egypt cap. Uh, okay, orange goes Indonesia, so they want Australia. Pink's probably going to go Brazil or Ukraine. Oof. Oof, these cap spots suck. I'm definitely not going South Africa. Oh boy, ladies and gentlemen, this is not good, but we'll do our best. I think we have to go Western Europe and just hope uh, that something opens up for us and we can transition the game. Peru's no good. I'm not going Peru. All right, let's go Western Europe with a five cap. I don't think the bot's going to roll our cap, so we're okay from the bot. The only player that can roll us is purple, realistically. I guess orange could roll us too, but they can go through it. have to go through a two stack first. I'm not too worried about it. By the way, guys, the channel's still growing. Appreciate all of my subscribers, my viewers. You guys are the best. Uh, if you're not subscribed yet and you want to support the work that I'm doing and help me out, you can do so by hitting that subscribe button. And guys, ladies and gentlemen, don't forget, smash that like button for me, please and thank you. Where does white go? It's like almost like no one really has an amazing cap spot except... Oh, hey, and speaking of subscriptions, Arch Knight, subscribe to the channel while I'm recording this video. Thank you, Arch. Appreciate it. Thank you for the support. White goes Venezuela. Pink might actually go North Africa now. And that would create a trading zone for them in South America with a white player. I could actually roll white's cap, to be honest with you. I could actually white roll white's cap. I think pink is deciding between uh, the Ukraine and North Africa. Or maybe Brazil, but I don't. I think North Africa is better than Brazil. Okay. Now here's the thing: if I roll White's cap, they do have that five stack that they can come and get me. Right? I'm only getting six troops. It would be a fourteen v six, uh, which is oh, oh sorry, I saw my face cam paused, which isn't a hundred. I think it is a hundred percent, but you know, I could lose twelve troops, right? And then white will get seven troops. Oh, no, they will not get seven troops because they won't have a cap. Interesting. I don't hate the idea. We can try it out, right? I generally... Generally speaking... Oh. oh, oh, I don't think I've ever seen that before. The bot rolled pink's cap turn one. That's incredible stuff. Okay, an orange rolls a... They, they wake up, they roll a two stack of whites. I don't know, guys. That's a pretty tempting cap hit. Uh, so what would it be? I'm not going to highlight it that in case I don't know. So it would be plus six. It would be a 14 V6.
It's pretty, pretty incredible. Okay, let's, let's go for it. One in Rome, right? Oh, 85%? Oh, we get god dice. So white also doesn't have a cap now. Now, I might lose this cap here to the bot, right? Or maybe even to white, right? Uh, but I don't really care about that cap so much. White's not, white's pissed. They're gonna roll a 9v10? Bro. <laughs> I'm gonna try and <laughs> Good luck, dude. Good luck. You're only getting three per turn. You will just end up suiciding yourself at this point, but we can uh, try it out for fun. All right, what's pink gonna do here? They can't. They've lost their cap. Also, they just get a cap in North America. Oh, sorry, get a, they get a they get a card in South America. Pass their turn. Let's hope that the green bot does not roll my cap. It might. There isn't. There is a. There's a slight chance that it might roll my cap. I mean, hell, it just rolled pink's cap, right? Uh, purple's gonna roll. The bot's cap. 7v3. That could fail. That could fail, for sure. I love this start so far. So we're going to get seven troops. I don't think the bot's going to roll my cap. Doesn't look like it. Oh, that's amazing stuff. Okay. Uh, where's my take? Uh, I think I take in Australia. If orange doesn't roll my three. I'm pretty sure we're safe now from... Now I... I could also switch caps and I could give I could give white um that might actually be a better play. I could give white a cap. Right? Maybe that's a good play. Then I can have a double guard. Yeah, let's do that. We'll give white the cap. Okay, I'm happy with that. There you go, white. You've got a cap, brother. Now, as far as I'm con like, I, I actually have quite a good kill guard here on pink. I've got a double kill guard, so I'm kill guarding pink. In South America and in Africa. What a hilarious, hilarious start. All right, let's talk about the settings quickly. It's uh, Capital Conquest. I gotta hide myself. On the classic map, auto setup, six second turn timer, hard, automated bots, progressive cards, balance, but dice, no rank restrictions, alliances, fog, and portals are off. Blizzards are on today. In position one, we have the purple player, Ken Kenaram from USA. In position two, we've got the uh, green bot. In position three, we've got the orange player, Hamid Dreza Far Hadmer. Uh, I probably butchered that. And they're from the United Arab Emirates. I'm as informed anything goes account. Oh my god, don't roll this. Uh, uh, currently ranks the Grandmaster. In position 5, we've got the white player, Banged Your Ma, from USA. Uh, and in position 6, we have the pink player, Dr. Dog, from USA. Who, who does not currently have a capital. Okay, I'll lose my position 
in Australia because because green green wants Australia real bad. Sorry, orange wants Australia real bad. Okay, so what do I do here? I don't take green's cap. I could actually change caps again and take green's cap. That also is not a terrible idea. Because the Egypt cap, I think, is better than both of these caps. Plus, I can allow someone in to come trade with me, right? Sure. Let's do that. I can give pink. Let <laughs> me change caps again. Musical caps. White wants the, that cap, they can have it. Maybe I can make friends with, with the white flare. So once again, we've changed caps. <laughs> I think the Egypt cap is much better. Does white take it? No, but this is good because now pink can take it. Okay, and pink says thanks. All right, musical caps, baby. And I'll say, well played. This <laughs> is hilarious stuff. <laughs> now, I, I did, I did leave pink some bot material back there, so pink does have a kill guard on the bot. But I think it's, I think, I think it's better just to get this caps kind of locked in. I think the combination of having a trading zone with pink and having the Egypt cap is better. And I've kind of, it seems like I've made amends with the white player, <laughs> at least for now. Okay, purple is stuck in draft. Are they not doing anything? Oh boy, okay, we may have our first bot. That was cool. Oh, actually, tip. Technically, our second bot, our first human transition bot. Okay. The AI did put everything here. Okay, green green bot trades. Trades on three bots. Always trade on three. That's my new rule. <laughs> and orange does hold... Australia. What a clusterfuck of caps right here. It's pretty, pretty funny. I definitely want to strengthen this nicely. Let's see if pink will trade with us. This is a good place to trade. This is awesome. Musical caps. White hated me for a second there. They totally wanted to, totally wanted to, to kill me. But the Egypt cap is good because it gives me a lot of access to, uh, it gives me good access to Asia. I can even loop around uh, Europe without opening white, White's cap. It's good. This cap's a little bit more restricted. Pink did not take a card in South America. Okay, that's interesting. And they didn't reinforce their cap. Okay, maybe I put, maybe I bet on the wrong horse. <laughs> okay, uh, green bot puts in Afghanistan. It's gonna do bot shit. 
I love that the bot rolled Pink's cap on turn one. That was that was just epic. I think Pink got their original cap back. Okay, Orange. Orange is a bit all over the place with their stacks. They gotta wa watch out. There is a bot out there, so they don't want to get their shit smacked, right? I really wish Pink would trade with me in South America. And I don't want to take all the cards in South America. Maybe Pink's worried about opening my cap. But they don't have to be, because they can just... Yeah, that doesn't really make sense. Okay, I'm actually going to hit. Hit bot. Unusual to do this early. Minus three. Of course. And pass our turn. Uh, purple did skip. Oh, wait, but purple skipped. Didn't skip on purple. Oh, maybe that was their, hey, I'm skipping thing. That Maybe that was the move where they a good player will pretend to skip by botting out so that in order to disguise the fact that they're skipping. And how many times can one man change caps? Okay, and white just kind of walks their stack home. Let's see if the green bot gives me a card in, in Europe again. So I don't really want to close that cap. But I also don't want to close the Venezuela cap. I also don't want to take all the cards that are available to me in South America. Yeah. So orange gets a four rolled, but it does open up their cap for them, which is always a good thing. Let's see what orange does. They're a bit all over the place, those stacks. It's not really good progressive capital um, stack management. Okay. They put everything in Ukraine. They really do smack that bot. Unnecessary splitting. Yeah, I don't think Orange is an experienced player. Are they going for Asia? Yeah, this looks, this looks like a player that wants Asia. Good luck with that. <laughs> Alright, so I get the eight. Uh, we'll trade the three of a kind. We'll put four here. So we've got... We'll want to put eight on this cap. The rest on this cap. And that should get us pretty closely aligned when this is all said and done. Two twenty-four stacks. Perfect. Only pink can kill the bot, because I gave up the kill guard on the bot. All right, what's white doing? All right, white gets a 10 trade. Most on cap. Where do the rest go? Okay, white's taking a little bit of time here. Definitely not a fast player. I mean, Pink should remove the bot, I think. They better get a card. Okay, so they do get a card in Greenland. Do they walk it all the way to cap? 
No, they don't. Okay. Maybe White's plotting some revenge against me for stealing their Venezuela cap. I don't know. I think if the bot doesn't trade, I'm going to remove it from Greenland. I know that will close my cap, but I think I'm pretty sure Orange is going to open it again. I kind of don't want the bot putting in anything in the Middle East, right? And maybe we can get the bot to stack in in um, Africa. Now, if the bot ends up, if this ends up becoming a bot card farm strategy and I lose to pink because I gave him a bot card farm, I'm going to be really mad. <laughs> okay, what's, what's, what is, what's purple doing? Oh, I don't like that because you take away Scandi. But the bot farm strategy won't really work very well because you can only get two cards off the bot. Oh, and of course it trades. And yes, it puts everything beside my cat. Bots always trade on three. Don't you? You quote me on that. They will always trade on three. Super, super annoying. At least it splits. At least it splits. I need pink to stop taking cards. Exterior. All right. Orange trades on three. What do they do? They're going to go for Asia, bro. This guy is going to go for Asia, and I, and I respect it. I highly respect it. No, you don't need anything on cap. If you're going for Asia, dude, you got to send it. Yeah, let's see it. Let's see it. Oh, yeah, Asia, baby. What an incredible move. This guy just wants to own the whole world. I think I have to trade here based on that. Because I don't want orange rolling this cap. So I'm going to trade a little bit early. Okay, well, let's see if we can get Pink to trade with us. Now, I'm in a bit of a predicament with the orange player right here. Because I could get rolled, right, on their next trade. They're going to be putting in quite a lot. Doesn't look like anyone wants to break them. The bot might break them. Pink might break them as well. Maybe pink breaks them in, in Kamchatka. Looks like they are. Okay. Good. I'm assuming they are. 10v6, not 100%. It's close, though. Good win. Okay. Fair enough. This is an awesome game. I love it. Purple, can you please move the nine? Man, is there a world here where I get card blocked? And Orange, don't forget, bro, I didn't break you, okay? It was the pink player that broke you, not me. That's going to hit the 8. That's really good for me. Really, really good for me.
I don't know what that reinforcement was about. Um... I really don't want to get rolled by orange here. I'm definitely not going to break orange. I open pink's cap to take South America. That should give me some extra troops. Um, not that I really need them, but it's better than nothing. This is a very, very strange board. I don't think pink's going to break orange again. Maybe they do. I've never seen someone get get their cap rolled by a bot on the first turn. I've never seen that. Uh-oh. Okay, well, thanks. Super aggro. And they say, I want... They're saying that I want Australia instead. <laughs> and they, they throw the white flag. What are the trades at? These guys are crazy. Trades are at 45 already. Orange is worth killing. Orange will be worth killing. Pink, not so much. Is purple going for the cap? Or are they going to go for the kill? Well, they ran out of time. What? Is there a world where I can cap run? <laughs> Hold on a second. Trades at 45. If orange suicides into pink right now, this game just opened the hell up. Oh my god. All right, let's let's think through this logically. Um, next phase, okay, let's go through this all. Don't fuck this up, Jonathan. doesn't set me in. I don't think that matters. I think I win. Oh shit. 
That's 100%. 96%? Yeah, baby! Yes! Love it! <laughs> I will take it! What a game! That was amazing! Uh, and 30 minute cap gain. Love it, ladies and gentlemen. Let's look at the ranks, see how we're doing. Okay, purple was intermediate, orange was a novice, white was an intermediate, and pink was a master. That was probably one of the funnest games of caps I've played in a while. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Follow me on Twitch. The link's in the description. Oh, shit. Well, you get to see my score now. And until I see you next time, you keep fighting that good fight.